Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, another question that comes to mind that is an interesting question because you might uh, wonder if there's uh, maybe an app or a browser that's favored more than another. Uh, the question that arose is simply does Windows security and smart screen features actually work on all browsers or only Microsoft Edge? And this is a protection actually that is system level. What means what it means is that it's in the operating system. So it's not dependent on any browser, it's dependent on Windows itself. Which means that if you use Microsoft Edge or if you use Google Chrome, you are protected from the um, downloads, you're protected from anything that could be malicious. It doesn't matter what the app is that you're using. So that is important to understand that it's not dependent on the browser. So even if you're using Firefox, you will see that it is also going to help you uh, protect yourself from the uh, the downloads of files it doesn't know what it is one of the biggest problems that I would say about smart screen is that depending on what you do you might sometimes have false positives um, I do amateur radio stuff and on amateur radio you have very unique apps that aren't downloaded very often because you know there's less people downloading certain apps for amateur radio than, you know, say Google Chrome. So sometimes the apps are, have not been signed and have not been identified by smart screen. So it might actually pop up a message saying, hey, you're maybe downloading something dangerous. Uh, if it does pop up, first of all, think about it. Are you downloading something legitimate from the official website? It's very important to know that. Um, and if you are clicking a link from somewhere and you have no idea what you're downloading and it tells you this is dangerous, you back away from it. You say, no, no, don't, you know, don't keep it and don't run it. It's going to tell you. But um, sometimes it can happen that false positive. So I have a few apps that I download on Windows in general. And whatever browser I downloaded from, it will have the same effect. It's going to tell me, no, this, this app isn't... Um, you know, a a, um, a good app, but sometimes it doesn't mean that it's a it's not a good app. But do follow what the uh, smart screen filter says. But um, like I said, these are not browser dependent, and most of the protections that you have in Windows security are operating system or system level protection. So wherever a download will come from, even from apps that are not necessarily a browser, if it downloads something, the protection and the security will be checking it out and will be an analyzing if it's safe or not to, uh, to use. Uh, but once again, I will say it again and again because that is the number one reason that you're staying safe. Um, you know, make sure that you download something from an official website that you know what it is, you know where it's coming from, you know, don't download shady things because even whatever antivirus you're using can easily, easily be bypassed by a lot of the malware out there. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.